Welcome back folks to another franchise mode video with the Nashville Predators. I am Mr. T-Man and we are currently in the round one of the Stanley Cup playoffs facing off against Chicago. We won our division and our reward is playing against Chicago so this should be fun. Uh, we will quickly affiliate. Yeah, sure. Why not? I will quickly check out their lines and then we'll start this series. Um, come on. I do know they have Kane and Taves, obviously. I'm not sure about Hosa. I think he retired last year. Um, they have Duncan Keith. They have, oh, they have uh, Debrincat. He won he had the most points as a rookie this year. So we'll see how they, they look. Uh, options, view opponents. So Panarin, Taves, and Kane. Oh man, that's a filthy first line. Um, quickly check out Taves and Kane. They had 70 points and Kane had 74 points. And then I know Debrincat had 66 points as a rookie. What about this Stransky guy? He had 58? Damn, this second line going ham. 54 points. So. I mean, that's what you want your second line to get, at least 50 points. And I think these guys hit it, even though their overalls are pretty low. Uh, even Debrincat's listed as a depth forward, same with Stransky. So I don't know how they did it, but they did it. And then Nismov, Delorier, and Hartman. Man, how many points did Nismov get? 20 goal season or 22 goal season with a 43 points as well. So their third line is looking good, I guess. Hartman, let's check out his stats. Basically 40 points. Delorier, how many did you get? 25 points. So they have the depth scoring. It may not look like it based off of their overall, but they, they have the depth. And then McNeil on the fourth line, perfect fourth line center. Uh, I mean, I don't even, I don't think we have a 84 overall on our fourth line. So I don't know, that's good, I guess. And then Nathan Gerby, J, uh, JT Brown, so I mean, Nathan Gerby is pretty small. I don't, I don't think you. Could, oh, yeah, five, five foot five, 178 pounds. Um, but 81, 281s on your fourth line is not the worst. It's actually pretty good. Um, and let's check out their defense. They got Jalmerson and Seabrook as their top pairing. So nothing to laugh at. I mean, it's still pretty solid. Our first pairing defense is definitely better. But ooh, Keith, you're an 82 overall now. Damn. Must have gone down during the season because otherwise I'm guessing he would have been on the third pairing. But Keith and Polka, polka has gone up. So that's good for Chicago. And then Girardi and Jelena as their fourth pairing. So that's really good for them, at least for, their, I mean, not their fourth, their third pairing defenseman, I guess. 284 is, that's, I don't know, it shows depth. I'm just guessing Keith went down overall wise during the regular season. And that's why he's still in that, uh, in, on the second pairing and then when it comes to their goalies they got Crawford Gustafson ooh Gustafson Philip Gustafson 21 years old medium starter so that's good and then scratch they got Eric Gustafson so that's their lineups quickly look at ours again I think it's pretty solid obviously they have uh, Kane and Taves nowhere near as good as Johansson and Neil but Forsberg's still pretty good uh, even though they, they didn't have the greatest season, I don't know, I think they'll be able to match them. If not, I mean, at the very least, be able to play with them. Uh, Matnin, Fiella, Smith, I like our second line, but you can't discredit what their second line did during the regular season. Wilson, Tierney, Tern Kamenev, pretty good third line, and Sharp, Watson, and Salmaki. Sharp went down two overall, but I'm not too worried. Uh, he is he's only on our fourth line, so it doesn't matter too much defensemen Those are our defensemen. They have a speed on the third pairing and in net they have the better backup But I think we have the better No, it's it's the same Bobrovsky and uh, Crawford are both the same overall so uh, Yeah, we'll see how we do uh, Before I start the series I forgot to turn on injuries in the last video so I'll quickly do that before I start this, uh, just I, if you're a first time viewer, the only reason I, whoops, don't want to save file just yet. Uh, the only reason I keep injuries off during the regular season, what did I do? 
team strategies. I want to go to settings. Uh, the reason why I keep entries off during the regular season is because um, I want the videos to go faster, I guess. I want the simulation to go faster and injuries uh, don't help with that. I'm not, I actually think it, it isn't that bad in this game, but in previous NHL games, it was like injury after injury after injury. I believe that was NHL 15. So there were a lot of um, broken things about that game. But anyways, injuries are on. So we got that. I was just looking for the sliders, but they are on this page, obviously. Um, general injury occurrence. Let's keep that at 15. And I got a text. Sorry about that. All right. Um, 15 and 15. So there we go. Hopefully that keeps injury occurrence down. Um, I'm not sure what the perfect number is, but I'll, we'll go with 15 for now. Uh, so here we go. First round of the playoffs against the Chicago Blackhawks. Can we win? Come on, guys. We have to win the first home game. Come on. First period. Here we go. 1-1. One, one, tie. Kamenev and JT Brown. So third and fourth line. Second period. Here we go. All right. All right. Neil and Matinen. Good job. Good job. Um, third period. I'll slow simulate it just in case. Don't want any surprises. There we go. Colin Wilson. All four lines. Actually, no. Yeah. No. Only the first three uh, lines have scored. Patrick Sharp makes it so that all four lines have scored. 5-1. Can we score on the power play? That'd be that'd be the real victory here, especially after our atrocious regular season power play record. And we win game number one, five to one. So I guess their inexperience is showing. Their older players might be a little slow, like Duncan Keith. That might be showing, and their goaltender wasn't that solid that game. So here we go, game number two at home. Can we win this one? It'd be huge for us and our fans if we could. Let's do this. First period. 0-0, zero, zero. all right. Second period. 2-1 Chicago. Uh, let's so, slow simulate this, see if we could tie it up. Come on, boys, it's just one goal. There we go. Colin Smith, Patrick Kane scores right after. So come on, boys, we need to come up with another one. Stop letting Chicago take shots. Come on, really power play. At least we killed it off. Come on. One more. One more. One more, please. There we go. Third line is coming in clutch. Going into OT. Ah, man, I'm losing my voice here already. It's only game number two. Uh, regular, no. Uh, slow simulation again. They're on the power play in overtime. Damn, how long is that power play? Come on. Take more shot. There we go. Matinin, overtime hero at home, wins it for us. Four to three. Game number two. All right. All right. That was a close game, but we clutched it up. Can we? Can we win game number three? We need to win one away to boost our confidence and obviously to help take a bigger lead in the series. First period. Here we go. Two goals at. Two goals away. Matinin. Coming in clutch, doing the work. Uh, Nemeth, <laughs> he scored like only three goals during the regular season, but he scores one for us in the second of game number three. And third period, we'll slow simulate it. And Hino Stroza on the second line scores right away. Come on, keep this lead, boys. Power play, score. Power play, please, no. Come on, keep the shots off. Prevent the shots, take the shots. Come on, four, three, two, one. And we kept the lead and we scored an empty netter. There we go. Oh my God. Matinen is showing why he's the better second line center in this series. I, where are you at to bring cat? I mean, I don't want to jinx it right now, but where are you at? Game number four. Can we, can we win it right here, right now? First period. one nothing us. Colin Smith, he's had a fantastic playoff so far. Uh, second period. Oh, one for Patrick Kane, one for Tierney. Damn, that third line is doing hot. Or is hot. Uh, ba -da -ba -ba. 
come on, power play, please let us score. Nope. Nope. Screw the power play. Can't count on it. Uh, can we hold this lead, please? Please, pretty please. Two, one, zero. There we go. We sweep the Chicago Blackhawks. It was actually, I don't know. It was a close series. I mean, that first game was a blowout. Second uh, game went to OT. Uh, that was basically a one goal game. We scored one empty netter and that was also another one goal game. So, damn. We were pretty good actually. I don't know why I backed off. Um, let's simulate to see who we are facing off against in round two and then I will check out the stats and then I will end the video there. All right, so damn, let's simulate again. A couple days, we're, we've been off for a week. And we're facing off against the Minnesota Wild in round number two, second place team in our division, if I re recall correctly. So that's gonna be a tough series. Uh, but yeah, Winnipeg, LA, Chicago and St. Louis have all been knocked out. Oilers against the Ducks, us against the Wild, Houston against the Bruins, and the Capitals against Philly. And in the East, uh, Tampa Bay, Toronto, New York, and Pittsburgh have all been knocked out. Alright, so Houston's doing pretty good, I guess. Um, quickly check out our stats, and then I will end it there. Player stats. Uh, damn, Matinin. Four goals in four games. Seven points, seven points, six points, four points. Paul and Smith, three goals. Oh no, Craig Smith. I, was, I don't know why I was thinking of Colin Smith. I was thinking of Colin Wilson. I don't know. But Colin Wilson was also pretty good on the third line. But Craig Smith, sorry man. You, you had a pretty good regular season as well. Um... Season stats. Yeah, basically 50 points, 22 goal season. So, doing pretty hot in the playoffs. So, that's all I could ask for. I'm going to end the video here, guys. If you enjoyed, please leave a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. If you have a way to help with our power play, please leave it in the comments section down below. I will see you in the next video. Peace. Played you fast and read you in. No slow recital. You waited for him on the strip. But no. Down. Down.